Aquaman Helmer James Wan took to social media and announced that the production of his 2018 film's sequel Aquaman and The Lost Kingdom has started. He posted a photo of a clapboard scene in an icy cave. The caption reads, Day 1, Hashtag Aquaman 2. Warner cancelled and exposed after thrashing Depp and backing Heard. After an allegation of the claim that Amber Heard might be in the wrong and a whole legal issue with Johnny Depp, speculation were rife that she might be fired from the role of Mira in Aquaman 2. Amber Heard is a part of a billion dollar DC universe since 2018. Jason Momoa, who played a titular role in Aquaman, is returning in the sequel as the half human and half Atlantean superhero Arthur Curry. Patrick Wilson, Amber Heard, and Yaya Abdul Mateen II will also be reprising their characters from the first installment. Aquaman in Lost Kingdom is slated to release in theaters on December 16, 2022. Knives Out 2 director Rian Johnson too shared the news with fans on social media that the film shooting has begun in Greece. Talking to Twitter, he wrote, And we're off. Day one of filming on the next Benoit Blanc mystery. Thanks to all the lovely, patient people here in Greece for letting us do all this murdering on their peaceful shores. In the project, Daniel Craig will be seen reprising his popular character of private investigator named Benoit Blanc, while Edward Norton, Dave Bautista, Janelle Monet, Kate Hudson, among others, also a part of Knives Out 2. Netflix has acquired the rights to Knives Out 2 as well as Knives Out 3 in March this year. The streaming giant is yet to announce the release date. The lengthy legal battle between Johnny Depp and Amber Heard has not only negatively impacted the star's image but also resulted in Johnny Depp being removed from the role of Captain Jack Sparrow from the Pirates of the Caribbean franchise. In the most recent development, it has been stated by Johnny Depp's friends that Amber Heard faked a bloody nose with a red nail polish. It had been reported that if Amber Heard is found faking evidence against her former husband, she might be looking at some jail time. Aquaman 2 shooting has not been scheduled to start anytime soon and hence the studio has a lot of time to decide what they plan to do about Amber Heard. According to numerous reports, Amber Heard has been fired from Aquaman 2. She has reportedly been expelled from any Warner Brothers production until further notice. It has also been reported that Change.org has been filed a petition against Amber Heard to have her fired from the Aquaman 2 cast. It has been reported by an entertainment website that an insider has confirmed that Amber Heard has been let go from Aquaman 2. The reason behind the decision taken is believed to be that the production house does not want to start filming and then get a red signal if Amber Heard is found falsifying evidence. However, film reporter Umberto Gonzalez claims in his tweet that Amber Heard has not been suspended from the Aquaman 2 cast. Twitter too seems to be divided about the news, while many claims that Amber Heard has been fired from her role. Others believe that she is still a part of the Aquaman 2 cast. There has been no official confirmation from Warner Brothers about the news. Jason Momoa says he can't start shooting Aquaman 2 because he got run over by a bulldozer while protesting construction of a giant telescope on land considered sacred to native Hawaiians. Sorry Warner Brothers, but we can't shoot Aquaman 2, he wrote in an Instagram post. Because Jason got run over by a bulldozer trying to stop the desecration of his native land, this is not happening. In a follow-up post, Momoa asked fans to support the protest movement, writing, During this time, we are trying to unite both Kanaka and Hawaii-born peoples alike to protect not only the Mona, but also our way of life and greatest natural resources in Hawaii as a whole. Moa has spent several weeks protesting on the highest point on the state of Hawaii, Mauna Kea, in an effort to stop construction of the 30-meter telescope or TMT, a $1.4 billion scientific project underwritten by a group of universities in California and Canada as well as partners in China, India, and Japan. Dwayne Rock Johnson also has been protesting the construction of the telescope last month. He made a surprise visit to the dormant volcano. Obviously, I've been following this for years now, more so as everything has been amping up more recently, but when you come here to Mauna Kea, you realize it bigger than a telescope. Johnson said, according to Hawaii News Now, it's humanity, it's a culture, it is people. Polynesian people who are willing to die here to protect this land. 
this is a very sacred land. According to the Los Angeles Times, the volcano top was selected as site of the telescope in 2009. In 2014, protesters disrupted a blasting ceremony, and in 2015, protesters were arrested for blocking access to the remote site, causing construction to stop. A few months later, there were more arrests and crews had to be pulled back. Hawaii's Supreme Court has ruled that the construction is legal. There may be a lot of fish in the sea, but there's only one amber herd. The actors will not be fired from the upcoming DC flick Aquaman 2 despite ongoing pressure from ex-husband Johnny Depp's fans. The superhero film's producer, Peter Safran, shut down a speculation that herd 35 would be cut in an interview with Deadline. I don't think that we're ever going to react to, honestly, pure fan pressure. You gotta do what you feel is best for the movie. We felt that if it's James Wan and Jason Momoa, it should be Amber Heard. It's really what it was, Safran said. One directed Heard and Momoa 41 in 2018's Akuman, which earned roughly $1.14 billion at a box office. The Hawaiian native played a title character and Heard portrayed his love interest, Mira. Listen, one is not unaware of what is going on in the Twitterverse, but that doesn't mean you have to react to it or take it as a gospel or a seed to their wishes," Safran added. You have to do what you feel is right for the film, and that's really where we landed on it. The official title of the action-packed, water-filled sequel is Aquaman in the Lost Kingdom. The film is currently in production and scheduled for a theatrical release on December 16, 2022. A Change.org petition to kick the Danish girl star of the franchise surfaced in November 2020. As of today, the online appeal has garnered over 1.8 million signatures. Heard and Depp, 58, were married from 2015 until their divorce was finalized in 2017. Divorce proceedings were extremely contentious, as she accused the parents of the Caribbean actor of abuse. She was granted a temporary restraining order and the LAPD found no evidence of abuse at the time. In 2019, Depp alleged that Heard abused him and he then filed a defamation lawsuit against Heard. Last year, Depp lost his libel suit against British tabloid The Sun, which had reported he was abusive towards his ex-wife. The publication called Depp a wife-beater in an article detailing the ex-couple's marital situation.